Hello everybody, my name is Brucify, and welcome back to Let's Play uh, Pokemon Silver. Now I want to apologize for two things. First off, all the yelling in the fucking background because my parents won't shut the fuck up. And two, I was actually supposed to record this about two hours earlier, but it's, um, I, uh, I fell asleep after work, and when I woke up, it said 6.50, and I'm like, oh shit, is it 6.50 in the AM? Oh. Oh yeah, right. Hang on, the music's gonna change a bunch. Get over here real quickly. Get that and get back over there. Hang on. Shut the fuck up. I really nobody wants to hear it. Now what they're what they're talking about is basically one of their lazy ass friends got like seven thousand dollars or something. I don't fucking know, and I don't really give a fuck. I always felt like the HM should be an option. Like, why can't I just have the HM and and that'd be good enough? Because I can't teach it to fucking Lapras. All right, so I so I guess I gotta fucking out. So I have to fly to another city to get. Or why can't I have like a seven Pokemon that can't be used for battling and only for? Well, I guess we gotta deposit Lapras because it's our water type. Withdraw. There we go. Oh wait, no shit! I'm an idiot. I don't want to be in this route. Yeah, sorry for all the. All of a sudden, wait. Oh yeah, fuck, I gotta teach it. Fuck it, I might as well teach it. And Whirlpool. There we go, alright. Now, when I admit, when I saw this, I'm like, oh my god, there's more to explore, look at this. I always thought Kanto was a weirdly shaped region. Like, okay, you know how in, um, because I see that there's like, five cities all linked to, all linked to each other, linked and very close to each other. So I just thought that was weird. And while Johto, it's like, kind of a straight line for adventure, this one has multiple different paths. So yeah, I always thought that was strange. Also, if you're patient enough, you can actually battle in this game, you can battle all the gym leaders in order, like how they were in the original games. So if you wait, if you're patient and you don't battle any gym leaders, uh, you can actually battle them in the order that you bought, you can battle them in Generation 1. In in the remakes, I think they fixed, I think they made it so you can't do that and you have to battle the gym leaders, otherwise you cannot obtain uh, certain items that will let you pass the Snorlax to get to uh, one side of Kanto. And the guards always pissed me off because why should I have to prove myself? Just let me do another fucking region. It's because they say lots of strong Pokemon are there. Bullshit! There's... The trainers are like level 30. The trainers are like. Oh, wait. Hang on. Just wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, nice. Okay, alright. Alright, got Slowpoke. Read that if you wanted to. And there's also Gold. And there's also Goldine. No. Oh, wait, I already have one. Okay, never mind. It's, it's not a big deal. Alright, here we go. Oh yeah, and the music's different, listen. Wait. Oh yeah, it's only different after you visit, never mind. Fuck. Alright, 
so let's just quickly defeat this girl. No, I'm not strong. You're just really weak. And this girl, and this old lady gives us sand, the uh, Darude Sandstorm Jam. And I, hey, funny thing, in the book, it recommends that you teach it to a rock, ground, or a steel type. Well, I have none of those. A rock! Have a have many rocks. Nice. Oh god! Oh god! That noise. Quagsire. Uh, good took a tick. Execute. All right, type closing. Nice. Why doesn't he have an executor? I don't understand. Okay, there we go. Oh, right. We don't have our fucking water type. Alright. Oh, wait. Uh, sand, just Sand Slash? Okay, watch. Yeah, you see? And... Ah, shit. Well, you could surf around it, but... Oh, nice. Perfect. Sorry, I'm just skipping through all these battles. I just want this to be quick because it's more—it's more or less the same, where you just, you know, battle with these trainers. Yeah, no fucking shit, mate. Oh, nice. Oh yeah, this guy out here. There's a guy out here. And he has uh, a Farfetch, I think. Yep. And Soul Silver, he says he's dedicated. And Soul Silver, he actually does make his Farfetch stronger. So yeah, let's just try to let's just try to defeat all these guys. not just about collecting them. I earned them, didn't I? Okay. Good battle. GG. Let's try using Grimer because it uh, it hasn't been... Or, or Grimer, fuck. Wheezing. I thought this lady turns around. Oh. Come on! There we go. Yeah, for some reason she has a Blastoise and a Pikachu. I don't understand. Stop being fully paralyzed. Thank you. Okay, alright. This is a saving grace right here. Because fully healed all our Pokemon. Alright. So, it doesn't... Lapras, we can't really train. Lapras is gonna get, like, a wor serious workout on the Dragonites. So, it's not that big of a deal. Alright, whatever. Let's just fight this guy. I know he has, like, a Parasect. Oh, nice. Oh, n never mind. He doesn't. I think it's the next guy. And dead. Shout out about your percentile Tiratatatas. I don't give a fuck. 
Okay, yeah, this guy has the curse set. And dead. And dead. And I believe the next guy has a... Has some... This girl has some... Um, oh yeah, this girl's talking about uh, my rival. Oh yeah, and I realized I did mi miss the, uh, I did miss Tojo, not Tojo Falls, uh, whatever the fuck the mountain's called, uh, with the Karate Master in it from the first generation, and it gives you a tie rod. See, so, yeah, I realized I did miss that, but I'll go back to that later. Oh, uh, after I beat the Elite Four, we'll do, we'll do the, some exploring, we'll do some exploring. I, uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, 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 yeah, right. Um, I got good news and I got bad news. The good news is, is that the, is that the, okay. Oh, the eight badges go. Please go right ahead, sir. You damn straight, fool. Go right ahead, sir. I really hope I saved the last time I played this, because I don't remember if I did or not. So yeah, there's good news and bad news. The good news is, is that um, this is probably the easiest uh, victory road ever. I mean, it's shared, it's the, uh, they pretty much had to, uh, some of it looks the same like this part where you get the two items, where you get the items here. We get two items here. Um, also, I think this split in the path is about the same. They had to redesign it, like, because, well, it, um, after Johto, the discovery of Johto, they needed to share it with trainers there. You know, since they didn't have their own Elite Four. Like, like, I don't understand. Oh, I could have caught that right home. Oh, well. It's not a big deal. Is it not? Oh shit, I missed the item. Sorry. See, this is why I like playing on ROM. I can just skip those parts. Okay, so get this. Oh, polar so Nice. Oh, wait, no, hang on. Imagine if I did it and I accidentally used the Master Ball. So, real quickly, we're actually going to go past this part, and we're going to go get that uh, Earthquake TM, because those are really good. Earthquake's a really good ground-type move, and this team is also hard to come by in games, so, yeah. Hang on. Who can... Wait, who can... In my current party can learn it. I don't think Lapras can learn it. Okay. Just kidding. Oh, uh, if you didn't hear, I heard my dad say, fuck you. I'm like, okay. Wait, Aircross can learn it in this generation? Well, fucking sign me up, man. Let me... Let me do this. Oh, my God. All right, so... We'll forget Fury Attack. So wait, can he learn Dynamic Punch? I don't think Heracross can. This is like the... No, he can't. It's a fighting-type move! He should be able to learn it! Wait, who can learn Solar Beam? Uh, Togeta Ken. Uh, nope, that's, that's pretty much it. I hate how Aerocross can't learn Fly. He can learn Aerial Ace, though. That's something. Okay. Alright, alright, let's fucking do this, mate. Well, what day is it? What day of the week it is? Is it Monday? I don't know if I have to fight him again in the, uh, league. Or... I think one time I had trouble with him, but it's because I avoided a lot of trainers. Oh, 
Oh, don't make me laugh. Was it like 40? Oh no, it's actually it's 38, so we're about matched. Uh, uh my speed is already slow already, but whatever. Come on, knock it out. Ah! Oh! Alright, this will knock it out. Okay. Most definitely. Because it earthquake. What the fuck? Was that a magneton cry? That sounded really messed up. fight in the air. But it could take a while, so let me just do this. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Never mind, it didn't take long at all. Haunter. Oh, wait, no, keep it, keep it, because Shadow Ball. What the fuck is with its cries? Fucking damn it. Adabra. Alright, we'll switch to. Switch to Weezing. Fuck it. Well, there we go. Nice. And that's how it's done, son. enough revives though I should probably should have bought more uh I have highly highly fucking doubt I'm going to win this I don't want to end the video because it seems it's so short You know what? Let's give it a ch try. Let's give it a shot at least with this with the, these low levels. Let's give it a shot, a chance, all that. We'll try and we'll most likely fail. I can't remember what our first Pokemon is, so I'm just gonna send out Ampharos. Right, so, so yeah, let's 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 let's, let's at least try. Oh yeah, I forgot. I always, always, and I always believe, and I will always believe, Will and Lorelai are related. They both wear glasses. They both wear sim. They both look similar. They both have red hair. Then again, in the remake, they made a made him. I think they they gave him like dark purple hair and like pretty much a redesign of his clothing. They took away all the red. 
Maybe, maybe it's because like so many people believe that they were related and they're actually not supposed to. They're actually not. not. Oh my God! It's all coming back to me. Psychic. It's all coming back to me. Not training your Pokemon and then just getting your ass handed to to you. That animation of Psychic will forever haunt me. Speaking of Psychic, we don't get it till can't till Kanto post game, so yeah. So yeah, that'll always haunt me though. Alright, Jinx. Let's send out Typhlosion. Because literally it's the best choice. But yeah. That psychic animation literally has taunted my childhood because when I see it I usually get w very close to death and then I just spam like um, using hyper potions and whatnot but of oh, oh wait oh shit I used the oh well it's okay they only use double slap but yeah I it will forever fucking taunt me and it still does to this day just because it reminds me of the fact that this is my get me get it. This is the move that's kicking my ass. This is what's driving me over the edge. We'll switch back to Ampharos. Yeah, this is the move that's driving me over the edge and really shoot beating the shit out of me. All right, Thunder Punch. Oh, it's okay, it only used Amnesia. Went way up. It went up by two. Okay, nice. It actually knocked it out. Nice. I think if it would have been any closer to death, he would have used the Hyper Potion. Can they do that in this game? I can't remember. Alright, we're gonna switch back to Typhlosion. Yeah, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be sad if I get real far into this and then I lose. Oh, oh yes. The, uh, one of the one thing you can do to help you get a lot of experience and is to just keep battling the elite four. Oh, if you're high enough level, but you're not high enough to defeat the champion, keep battling the Elite Four. Wait, oh yeah, it was that too, right? Keep battling the Elite Four over and over and over again until until you're you're starting to make some progress. Yeah, I know that's not like the best strategy, but it's I, it, I'm pretty sure it'd be faster than uh, grinding. Ah, uh, fucking hell. Oh, oh my god, yes, thank you. Alright. Alright. Um, I kind of, I kind of don't want to play this that long, but at the same time, I want to keep playing because I want to try to beat it. The main reason is because I, if I didn't work at fucking 6 in the morning tomorrow, I could play as long as I want, but the truth is, I do work at 6 in the morning tomorrow, so... Yeah. Oh yeah, um... My boss, at work, it's funny because he looks like... Chadtronic. He like, he's like a combination, his hair do and his face is like kind of a combination mixed free crossing free crossing of Chadtronic. And Rick Moranis. I thought that I just thought that was funny. I had to bring it up. But yeah, my boss look kind of looks like Chad Tronic and if uh, the love child of Chad Tronic and Rick Moranis. I like how Balrog is the love child of Reggie Fisame and James Rolfe. Yeah, that's, at the time when he said that, I had no idea who Reggie Fisame was. And I'm like, oh, he's the head, he's like the head CEO of Nintendo. Oh, cool. My body, and he's responsible for the greatest meme, one of the greatest memes ever. My body is ready. <laughs> oh god, fucking Nintendo World Championships. He's like, my body is. He's like saying to that guy, my body is ready. Wait, hang on. All right, we'll, we'll try flying. We'll try a flying type move. Why not? Oh, 
Uh, the only other Elite Four member I have trouble with is... Well, actually, um... Actually, I only have... I have trouble with three or four of them. Koga is probably the easiest to fight because, you know, he uses bug types. Uh, but the... The hardest... Like... Oh, shit. Oh, nice. Okay, we're gonna... Oh, shit. Nope. Nope. Ah, uh, switch to... Okay. Wait. Double edge? That would do it. Nah, I won't do it because that does damage to myself. Muck. Alright, Heracross. Sorry, I'm just gonna skip this. Because this guy kind of... Kind of, um... Uh, sometimes delays things, so I'm just gonna speed through this. Fuck. Nice. There he goes. So, back to Tokatik, I guess. Yeah, so he's... So he's, he's a, re, he's kind of a joke. He became, I think he was hard, I think he was harder as a gym leader to be honest. Nah, I take it back, he was, he's, he's a pushover both ways, he's not that good. Alright, so we're gonna use a hyper potion. And a full heal. So we're not walking around, we're gonna use another hyper potion, that hyper potion. Ah, uh, that should be good, alright, let's keep going. So, yeah, this is the trainer I always have trouble with, so we're gonna switch to, uh, Lapras because of his two Onyxes. And then I'm gonna try to fight, uh, overcome the power of his, uh, fighting types with Weezing, because Weezing has pretty high defense and is resistant to fighting type moves. However, I think some of them have Earthquake, so it's not, it's not like... It's not a perfect strategy. I'll I'll have to basically fight his power with my power. That's how I see it. I just have to overcome every fucking fuck. I thought his first Pokemon was Onyx. Oh, well, his his um Hitmon Top doesn't do too much damage. Hitmon Lee. All right. So yeah, I'm gonna be speeding through this one too, just because. Well, yeah. Alright, so right now we're gonna poison gas him, and then we're gonna sludge bomb him. See, look at this. Look at that! His Hitmon Lee is like his strongest Pokemon, besides his Hitmon... Hitmon... No, his, uh, Machamp. Alright, so yeah, I saw that he's gonna bring out Onyx. Hitmonchan. Bring it back to Weezing. Alright. Oh, oh my god, yes! A champ. All right. So I'm going to be using this hyper potion. Oh, that did not do much damage. Oh my god. Oh, you son of a bitch. Come on. Come on. Yes. Oh yeah. I thought he had two on. Oh whatever. Oh wait, no. That's the that. The Hitmon top replaced his other Onyx from the first generation, so yeah, that's that's something. Oh yeah, hang on. So Karen is probably the worst out of all of them because her freaking Umbreon can take some hits. Alright. Okay, I think his her first Pokemon is either Actually I think it's the I think it's the Umbreon. Ah oh, shit. Oh, I should have switched out. Oh whatever. Yeah, sorry I'm skipping these, it's just that, um, they kind of drag on a bit as it goes on. Well, except for Koga's, I just wanted to get through Koga's real quickly. This one probably drags on the longest. Like, look at this. Ah, shit. Alright, we're gonna try... I guess we'll try Weezing. Ah, uh, wait. Ah, shit! Alright. Oh, nice! Nice fucking work, Weezing. Alright, next we're gonna switch to Ty uh, Typhlosion. And knock it out. Vileplume's easy. Gengar is not that easy. Do I have a max revive? Yes, I do. Okay, so we're gonna bring back Lapras. Okay, okay. I don't know what move he did used to... Okay. Uh, I have no comment for that. Next is Lapras. Or er, Murkrow, fuck. Ice Beam. 
Okay, um... Houndoom is her strongest... Oh, what the fuck? Level 47. I don't remember being that strong. Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy shit! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh my... Oh, oh my... Oh... Shit. If I actually win this, I'm gonna shit my fucking pants. Okay, so let's uh, go to... Our, let's go to our hyper potions. Alright, hang on. And heal everyone. Everyone. Hang on, who's the closest to leveling up? Whoever is, I will, I will not use a rare candy on. Alright. Heracross is nowhere near, so I'm gonna use a rare candy on it. Okay. okay. Everyone's like halfway fuck. Okay. Any level 38? Nope. Oh yeah, took a tick. Oh, and okay, I'll use the last one on Lapras because, um, yeah, I wanted to. Hang on, is it holding anything? Yes, it is. Okay. All right. So, I'll I'll have the whole gold berry held by Ampharos because you know, uh, King, uh, uh, freaking Weezing can tank hits pretty well. Oh wait, mystery berry. Yes. Use it on Sludge Bomb. Oh wait, I should, probably should have used the fucking Max Elixir or something. Whatever! Alright, alright, whatever. So let's just go, let's go. Okay, here we go, here we go. I really hope this video, if we win, this video doesn't fail to render. Um, because if it does, I'm gonna be really pissed. Because, yeah, this is a very crucial moment in the game. Okay, so I'm pretty sure his first Pokemon is Aerodactyl. Or no, wait, I think it's... Well, whatever it is, we can just hit it with Ampharos. Aerodactyl or Gyarados. Which is pretty much the main reason why I trained an electric type. Alright, here we go. Some of the best music in video game history. Like, when I did... When I was playing this... I was playing this on the ga my Game Boy Advance at school, and they heard they heard the music go quiet for a second, and it's like, oh, you're on the final boss, are you? I'm like, yep. One girl actually actually asked me to turn down my game, and I told her no, and she just turned up her crappy music. So I'm like, so yeah, I just. Uh, oh shit, is these? Yeah, the problem. Okay, the problem with three Dragonites is you don't know which level Dragonite. It, this could be his 51. I know it's 47. Okay, he's probably gonna try to pull all three out. Of, all three out of one. So, yeah. Oh yeah, I can't do Surf. Oh, cross your fingers. Oh shit, is that why he used? Survive. Oh my god, I actually. Oh! Oh my god! Oh! Oh my fucking god! What is he gonna use next? Oh, he's gonna use another Dragonite. Uh, do I have anything to counter that? It sucks that my Heracross can't learn Rock Slide. At least I don't think it can. Uh, we're gonna try to tank it with Weezing. We'll try throwing out Poison Gas if we can. Because we don't have any, uh, Toxic. Okay. Okay, full restore that shit. Oh, oh my god. Alright, self-destruct! Boom! Alright, then we're gonna use Tokatik. Return. Alright, fly. Oh god. Okay, okay, that didn't work. Lapras. Ice Beam. Oh, oh my god, it fucking knocked it out! Yes! Dragonite. Nice! That's his biggest threat! That is his biggest threat on his team, is fucking Dragonite! That's it! We've won, pretty much! We fucking won! Oh my god! Okay, 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 relax, relax. We're not through the... He still has Charizard. Fire Punch! Fire Punch! Oh my god, alright. Alright, uh, Lapras. Surf. Aw, oh, fucking hell. Heracross. Strength. Fuck! Hang on. Before we do anything stupid, let me use my Max Revive. And my face cam just cut out. Nice. Just because I'm about to have the perfect reaction ever. Wait, 
Oh yeah, we don't have any more racks to revive. All right, we're gonna have to use a regular revive. Uh, I don't think I have any Pokemon that are faster than his. All right. Oh, oh wait, wait, wait. Yes! Yes! Oh my god! Oh my fucking god! Yes! I didn't. This is not. It. This is. This is. And the only th I have not load state at all. I haven't made any mistakes. All I did was like speed through the battles using the turbo space turbo space bar button. But oh my! F are you kidding me? Oh my fucking god! I'm sorry, but j Jesus, I actually won! Oh my god! Oh my god, I I was gonna like, ex I was expecting to lose and then I was gonna use a day to train my Pokemon to like 45, which probably would have guaranteed me victory by the way, but the fact that I won at such a low level is incredible. I have beaten Red and Soul Silver with a team of only level 70 Pokemon. It was pretty damn hard, but I actually, but I did do it. I don't think I could ever replicate that, though. I don't know. Maybe I could. I don't know. I guess you can say it's been like three years, Lance, huh? It's been three years since you did this? It's been three years since... Yeah. yeah one, th one nice thing about the remake is that you can clearly see the difference between Red's clothes and and Ethan's clothes, or gold, whatever, however the fuck you want to look at it. But, yeah, that's that's the nice thing. You can clearly tell the difference in... I think that's, like, one of the main reasons why they remade the game. Because, in this game, your character looks like Red! Your character's sprite looks a lot like Red! I am shocked that they could... Like, he's supposed to have a gold and black hat. Gold in the front, black at the back. Why couldn't they do that? Was it... I guess... I guess it would have eaten too many... Dude, is the reason why your character looks so much like Red is because... Well, in the old world, at least. Is it because, like, they ran out of space? Probably... Probably so. Rendering is... Rendering... Rendering the fun of him. Like, even... The, like, even this shot. Like, it doesn't look like his hat's gold. It looks like his... Hat's white and black, and his clothes are red, white, and black. And even the shorts. And your Pokedex is coming together. Oh, nice. Okay, so that's it. We beat Pokemon Silver. We beat Silver. Oh my! No, just kidding. I'm not. I'm just fucking around. I, we, I know. For I know as much as any Pokemon fan that the fact is, after this, we have to go. We have another region to beat. Yeah. So, um, this is this is not the end. It's. It's, we're only halfway done the journey. Well, technically we're three quarters because Kanto is pretty barren. The gym leaders are kind of easy, and and the gym, the trainers are extremely easy. And it's yeah, it just feels barren. There's like a lot of things that were stripped. There was supposed to be a Safari Zone. I mean, I, I know a lot of Pokemon fans know this by now, but there was supposed to be a Safari Zone in Silver, Gold, and Crystal. Or at least silver and gold. I don't think I don't think the map is. I don't think you. I don't think the map you can is available in crystal. Like you can't access the map in crystal. I think they just removed that together. Anyway, um, if you hack your way into the map, you can get in, but you can't get back out because there's no X. There's there's a warp point into it, but there's no warp out of it, so you're stuck in there. And apparently the Pokemon there are. I think there's Pokemon in there. I'm not sure. They tried making, and there's like an unfinished fountain sprite in the overworld that they tried making, but it's not done. So yeah, which is why I love the remake so much because it adds so much more. It makes it, it makes it feel so much more complete, like a gang bang. Just kidding. Fuck. Oh. And okay. So yeah, I will. We're. Alright guys, I will see you in the next video. Next time, we're heading to Kanto.